Hi, ni hao, I'm Chef Tom. Welcome to Fortune Cooking. Today I'm going to show you how to make a very delicious, simple appetizer as a ginger tangerine ground chicken meatball. Okay, I got the ground chicken here, pretty lean, and I have the black pepper and uh, potato flour. I zest some uh, the tangerine skin, very fresh, and uh, fine chopped ginger, honey, light sodium soy sauce, the egg white, one egg white, and I got this uh, panko, the flake of uh, Japanese uh, uses for like a uh, tempura shrimp, uh, fried pork chop, and uh, tempura vegetable. Okay, I put it in the pan like this. I'm gonna show you how to make it. Okay, I'm gonna add all the ingredients in. Egg white, light sodium soy sauce, and the honey. And then the ginger and the tangerine zest, and then the potato flour. I'm gonna grind some, grind some black pepper. And I'm gonna wash my hand really good. I'm gonna show you how to make it. Okay, now I'm gonna use a pair of chopsticks. I'm gonna mix up all the ingredients real quick first, like this. Okay. And then, after a little bit, I'm gonna use my hand. Make sure you wash your hand real clean. And you just kinda like uh, mix it up well. And the trick is I try to pound the meat to get the nice and sticky. So I can make a bunch of little tiny ball and roll over the panko breadcrumb and I'm gonna bake it, okay? See, now it's getting thicker. You just keep doing that. Like this, see? The meat is start getting thicker now. So well done. See now, it's really nice and sticky. Okay. Okay. Next thing, I just gonna uh, put the meat and put it in my palm. Just like squeeze it a little bit, like a foam little ball. I just gonna roll into the panko here. Okay. Just like this. I put it in the baking pan and I put a parchment uh, sheet paper. Just like this. Watch. Just like this. Okay. It's kind of fun. If you want to uh, roll over your hand into a little small ball like this, will be good too, okay? So, that's how I'm going to do it. Like this, okay? It's very healthy. Uh, if you want to use to fry, it's okay. Put 350 and fry it, which is good. But uh, I like to use it like this. It's kind of fun, alright? Just keep trying, keep practicing. You will get it. Just like this. Alright, I'll show you one more. You grab the meat like this. And just squeeze it out like this. Squeeze it out. Don't have to be perfect. Like this, okay? And you can kind of like a roll a little bit round shape in the panko here. Just like this, see? Kind of nice and round. Alright, I'm gonna finish up. And at the meantime, I uh, have the oven preheated for 400. And then uh, I'm gonna show you how to bake it, okay? I can show you a little trick. What you do is you squeeze a little bit like this. Just keep squeeze like maybe four or five, like this. Like four, and I got last one, five, and you put it in the pan, and you just mix it up. Mix it up like this, okay? One, and then you just mix it up like this. Roll a little bit, two. See, it's very fun to make. And I got three more extra, okay? Okay, that's what it looked like when it's done. It's about close to one inch round, and um, I preheat the oven for 400. We're gonna put this uh, into the oven for 10 to 12 minutes. And um, I see you later. Here is your ginger tangerine meatball with either turkey or chicken. <clears throat> the garnish, um, the dipping sauce, I put Thai, sweet chili, and sriracha. I mix it in a little bit. That's what it look like. And you just um, dip in with it. Or you can just uh, do all kind of um, idea that you can have. Drizzle with uh, some other uh, olive oil, mix it together. You can drizzle on the top of the meatball, or you can use for dipping. Okay, and here we go. I hope you like the video. I'm Chef Tom. Thank you for watching Fortune Cooking, and please subscribe and comment. I see you next time.